Hey everybody, it's Coach Ash, team leader of Team USS Rockstar Nations, and today we're going to talk about tracking and why it's important. Well, why do we track? We track because we want to create traction, right? We want to create progress. We want to go forward. Yeah, we take steps back sometimes, but we really want to reach our goals. Tracking is a key, critical, very critical part of goal setting. Uh, that treasure map that we talk about creating in my Rockstar's become a rock star video, uh, it includes a lot of tracking. You need to set a goal and then you need to track your journey to the goal. Um, let's talk about why we track or the reasons that we track. Let's just, let's talk about that. So the first thing is that tracking creates that laser focus. Like you are zoomed in on exactly what's going on, what you're doing, how it's going. So that's the first thing. Secondly, when you aren't tracking, you tend to focus on the downside, the failures, the things that didn't go as you planned, the things that, you know, oh, that's not really what I wanted to do, or, or the one bad day you had. You tend to focus on that kind of stuff. And when you're on the mission to set up, to reach a goal, when you're on that track, you want to focus on the good stuff so that you keep that encouragement and that momentum and that consistency. You don't want to get a chance to get off of that that path because it's very, very easy to do, but yet much harder to get back on. Once you lose the momentum, it's much harder to get it back. So thirdly, we want to track because, well, how do you eat a whale? One bite at a time, right? So the thing about it is, you want to make a goal, right? But then you want to break it down into tiny steps or into smaller chunks. The same way you eat a whale. Granted, he doesn't go bad before you eat the entire thing. <laughs> so you want to break it down into those smaller chunks. And not only does it make it easier for you to reach your goal, but you feel more accomplished as you go on. Because as you conquer each smaller goal, then you feel, you're feeling like you're making progress. I'm making progress. I'm, I'm making my way. I'm halfway there. I'm three quarters there. I'm a quarter there. Well, however far it is. Um, another reason that you track is because it shows you what benefits you. So you, it shows you what actions are not maybe aren't so good for you, what actions work for you, and it gives you the advantage of knowing, hey, I should do this again. I should do this more, okay? Um, let's talk about what you can use tracking for. You can use tracking in your everyday life. Um, I personally, everybody knows, you know, I'm an independent beach body coach, so I use it in my business. Um, I use tracking for my clients. Um, I use tracking for my new coaches, my team members training. I use it for people I've talked to. I use it for my diet and exercise. Like I, I track all of my food. I track my workouts. Um, I even use it to know like what chores I have, what events I have coming up and all of these things lead up to something, some big picture. But then I also track for smaller things like um, what bills needs to be paid and paying down debt and how far I've gotten and things like that. Like if you have a credit card bill you're trying to get rid of or maybe a student loan or your car note or something like track that too. It's, it's, a, it's a sense of accomplishment and it keeps you happy and on top. It keeps you going, keeps that momentum. All right, so what are some ways to track? Well, if you're doing diet and exercise, I suggest uh, Fitness Pal is a really good one. Um, Live Strong is okay for tr tracking your calories and even your exercise. But um, if you're one of my clients or customers or even coaches, I suggest the Wowie Super Gym, um, which is part of my website on Team Beachbody. That, because likely, if you're my customer, you'll be using a Beachbody program and you're able to track your Beachbody programs, your calories, and not to mention you have a community of other people who will be using those programs with you and you have another form and community of support. And as everybody knows, I like to say that success comes with support and accountability, which is what you will get at the Wowie Super Gym. Uh, another way to track is good old pen and paper. Now, I'm a pen and paper kind of girl. I'm a bookworm, so I love to write things down. But my problem is 
I lose everything. Like, I totally lose everything. So I do need to stick with electronics for tracking. And if you do like pen and paper, that's fine for the initial. But if you're one of the kind of people like me who likes to be all over the place, then you might want to find a way to file it electronically so that you can recover that at a later time. Um, if you are tracking electronically, I like to suggest an Excel spreadsheet. Um, I have a spreadsheet for so many things and it sounds tedious and it sounds like a lot but it saves me so much time in the end and so much frustration when I'm looking for something or want to know you know who I need to contact or what I need to do or what my next program is going to be that's very very important to me so now that you know why we track and a few ways how to track and how you can apply it in your daily life it is time to take what action it's time to take action so i challenge you right now to choose one goal in your life that you're that you are trying to reach one goal and find a way to track it after you have figured out how you're going to do it please comment in the suggestion box or in the comment box below this video again don't forget to subscribe and happy friday have a great day guys party on